Hey guys, this is my Keisha coming to you from out of Chester. And out here, people call me the Cake Boss. And this is one of my cakes that I've done today. It's a two part cake. They wanted a church hat, so to say, and a shoe. And they wanted lavender because I'm assuming that's their color or her favorite color. So let me tell you about the shoe cake. This is just sitting on a nine inch double stack dirty ice covered in white Wilson fondant and then I airbrushed it with like a pearl so it's not white white it's like a pearl shimmery color my shoe I did probably a week ahead and I have a template that I use and it's a template that I just made up so it's nothing that you know I can tell you go find it or you know you can buy it somewhere um, I have fondant roses that I also sprayed with the same purple so give you a better look because I can't turn it because it's so big. And then just to blink it out, I got some silver, I guess sugar it is. Let me see if it come around the back. So that's what the back looked like. A little blinged out. The insole, just a different color. And this is made out of fondant. Normally when you do shoes like this, then you will want to use gum paste so it can dry i did have a problem with it drying because i use find it and not gum paste so word to the wise always use gum paste it takes less time for it to dry and you won't have to worry about breakage so let's get over here to the hat the hat is very big we have three 10 inch rounds stacked together dirty ice and i just carved them down because i didn't want it to be such a, a boxy cake then we have a fondant bow. And I also sprayed this with my shimmery lavender. The same as the shoe. It's not really much I can show you guys. Because I can't turn all the way around. So you get the idea. We have the brown all the way around. And we just finished with the sugar. My bow. I did that a day ahead. Because I knew you know, it will dry. Because it's just leaning up against the cake. And my glue for this cake, guys, was roll icing because I needed everything to stay put. So, guys, this is my shoe cake to the left and my hat cake to the right. And I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. And this is the Cake Boss from Chester. And you guys can find me on Facebook at JJ Sweet Tooth or find me on my website at JJSweetTooth.com. Shoot me a comment. Let me know what you think of my cakes. As always, guys, thanks a lot. The shoe is the pride and joy. Oh, look, it goes around. So, there we go. Again, guys, thanks as always. Till next time.